speak of the devil. I'm hungry. I'm wor really worried I ain't gonna be able to find any place to eat. And then I cross the corner. <laughs> I get a cramp. That hurt. It still hurts. But then I, uh, oh, look at that. Ah. Uh, good old Mickey D's. Oh, I will eat there. I don't want it. I'm gonna walk in that direction, and what I'm thinking is, like, uh, McDonald's probably around other places that are gonna feed me. <laughs> it's probably gonna be in that, that kind of eating area. So if I'm lucky, if I'm lucky, uh, oh, I'll find a good place to eat that is not McDonald's. If I don't, I'll have a fucking Big Mac. I don't fucking care. I, <laughs> Almost sort of looking forward to it, so. Uh, I mean, uh, <laughs> don't judge me. Do not judge me. It's fucking delicious. Well, this one corner has made me super goddamn my hair's messed up happy. Uh, this little store right here, the Hair Moist the Takahashi, the hair salon. I remember seeing that because I made fun of it to myself. <laughs> remember seeing that on the night that I came back from the, uh, the soccer uh, barbecue thingy on Sunday, so I know I haven't strayed too far and I'm pretty sure that's the way I gotta go. So what I'm going to do, since I don't wanna go back the exact way I came, I'm gonna remember this location and I'm going to specifically try and go down this road. Ah, uh, no, holy shit. <laughs> uh. Uh. Uh, that's kind of cool. So I'm wrong, but in a totally cool way. So this corner that I'm at right now, all the uh, baseball players driving by. It's the um, it's the place that I stopped walking uh, walking at. Uh, what was that? Like Monday, Tuesday, Sunday? No, yeah, it was Sunday morning before the before the soccer uh, barbecue. I told my family I was gonna walk out for an hour. I walked to this exact. Actually, I walked to that corner right there uh, where they're all crossing. I walked to that corner. I think I may have walked a little further. I think I walked into this parking lot. So all these big boxes was laughing really hard. And then, uh, and then I had to turn around because I, I, had, I had only walked for about 30 minutes. I was walking down uh, this street, right, where that I'm kind of walking up right now. So that's the street I walked down. And it literally leads all the way up to a, um, a DVD shop. Um, kind of like a, kind of like a Hastings or something. Holy shit. I mean, that's blowing my mind, though. Uh, that's the weirdest thing in the world. Just by chance, I end up wrapping my, my rat all the way back to a location that I've been before. <laughs> a location I've been before uh, when I was just aimlessly wandering around a second. Oh, that is... That is killing me. All right, well, anyways. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna walk inside the family work. I'm gonna walk inside the family work. I'm gonna walk on inside and see they have another one of those Lopi stations. See, last time I went to a Lopi station was a loss. I was trying to get a ticket for the event. It's tomorrow. Right now, actually, the concert's a two-day concert, and the first of the two days is today. Uh, again, I was gonna try and go get the ticket, blah, blah, blah. Decided not to, because I wanted to do whatever the fuck I'm doing right now. So I'm gonna go inside Thumbing Mark, because I, I know that they have uh, their own type of ticketing system, and I can't remember if it's Lopi or if it's not. If it's not, maybe there's a chance that they have a set of tickets that Lopi didn't, uh, but of course, uh, it's, it'll be a it'll be a lost cause because even if they do, uh, that that ticket probably was already sold out far before now, anyways. And uh, uh, if they don't even have, they they probably don't even have a have one of the, like the little Lopi stations anyway. So uh, I'll walk in there, just see, walk around for two minutes, and I'm gonna head back out. Then I'm gonna go this way. That's the same way for the McDonald's, and our, like, it's a big fucking food market too. I'll probably just walk around, not buy anything in. Or maybe I might buy something. Maybe I can buy something like make myself didn't not enough. <laughs> but, holy shit, I'm still, like, this is mind-blowing, but I'll see you guys probably when I get uh, to the McDonald's area. tickets wasn't expecting but hey they did have a station which is kind of nice in fact I think 7-11's might have the same station 
I don't know. I, I just never looked for the station where it was. And that, that fucking family one was, was looked identical, identical to the 7 Eleven right next to the street. It's the craziest thing. So, anyways, I, I found uh, this station. Look at that, it's two stations away from Hotogaya. Uh, so, if I ever really did get lost, I could just, you know, take the train back. Then I would definitely know how to get back home. But no, no, I think I'm okay. I think, I'm, I, think, I, think I can go back the way I came. Walk back up. I know that's about a 35 minute walk. And in the meantime, I wasn't lying, man. It's, it's a motherfucking food garden. It's a big fucking food store. I'm gonna go inside. I'm gonna go look at all the food I could buy and could be making, but probably won't because I uh, don't think I'm allowed in the kitchen. So <laughs> let's go check it out. See now, America tends to have those like little coupon things jetting out from aisles. Japan has little televisions <laughs> uh, as commercials for the products they're advertising. So the supermarket was cool. It's like a really small, like uh, Safeway, super small, like uh, 12 aisles or something. Maybe it's uh, like half the size of Safeway next to my house. But uh, I'm just not gonna care. I'm going to McDonald's. It's not just a McDonald's. It's a McDonald's and a Studio Alice. I don't know what that is. But uh, I see like five different entrances, and I see a spinning McDonald's sign. So totally fine by me. <laughs> and it's cheap too. Like I said earlier, no judgment. <laughs> 